Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Ashlyn and I'm so glad that you clicked on my link. And if you're not new here, welcome back. And today's video is going to be super duper fun. So this week on my Instagram, I asked if you would like to see my Disney ear collection or my Disney pin collection. And most of the votes were for an ear collection. So I am going to be showing you all of the ears that I have and a lot of people think I have a lot like my especially my family my my parents will walk in my room and my dad's like oh my gosh look at all these ears I can't believe you spent this much money on ears but then you know you see a lot of people on YouTube or in the Disney world who have like literally hundreds of ears which is crazy but anyways i'm going to show you all of the ears that i have some people prefer disney parks ears over small shop ears or handmade ears and then some people are the other way around they hate disney parks ears and they love small shop ears but i love both it doesn't matter to me i have a ton of disney parks ears and a ton of small shop ears um so what i'm going to do is start with my disney parks ears ears that you can actually get in disney world or i have got in Disney World um, that kind of thing and then I will go into my small shop ears and I will link all of the small shops down below in case you want to go check them out and um, see what kind of ears they have to offer the first pair of ears I'm going to be showing you today are the ones that I'm actually wearing these are the purple potion ears from Disney Parks and when these came out it was towards the end of my college program and I was on the verge of being like negative ten dollars in my checking account and I said you know what I don't care I have to have these ears because they are so beautiful and I love them so much I'm gonna show you a close-up here they are they are incredibly gorgeous the purple is probably the most beautiful purple color that I've ever seen ever um, the bow is like a shiny purple metallic and then it, they've got like it's like purple iridescent with a little bit of I don't know I just I feel like these are some of the prettiest Disney Parks ears ever and I love them the next pair of ears I'm gonna be showing you are the Mickey's 90th birthday ears and I am obsessed with these so these ears are incredibly gorgeous they are gold and kind of like a champagne -y color they're very classic looking and they actually go well with my nails but you've got a black and champagne shiny bow you've got gold glittery ears the sequins on them are so pretty and then on the side they actually say Mickey 90th hashtag Mickey 90th or Mickey 90 whatever you know what I mean hashtag Mickey 90 and they're super cute and the cool thing about these ears is the bow actually comes off and so it's kind of I think it's supposed to be kind of like a bow tie thing like you have a bow tie and then you have your bow for your ears but I love this because you can also wear the ears with no bow that's kind of a trend like a lot of people on Instagram you see they're wearing um, ears without a bow which is kind of cool I kind of want the pair of black ears that are currently in the parks like that but anyways moving on so yeah this is a really super cool element to these ears I probably will never wear the bow tie I wore it once on my program and my roommate Claire got a hideous picture of me the next pair of ears are also Disney Parks ears they are the Minnie Mouse old version of Minnie Mouse ears kind of like um Minnie Mouse way back in the day and it, normally it has a little daisy flower coming up from these but the reason why it doesn't is because I got these at Cast Connections. If you don't know what Cast Connections is, it is this big warehouse type place where cast members can go and buy merchandise that is either slightly damaged or it's kind of old type stuff like Christmas stuff from last year or that kind of thing things that didn't sell they will take to cast connections and you can get it for way cheaper so that was a place I went a lot on my program it was not good for my wallet but it was super fun and this was a pair of ears I got for there for five dollars let me give you a close-up these ears are so gorgeous and fun and I actually like them kind of better without the daisy coming up on top of it because I feel like it would flop around and bother me on my head um, but they are this gorgeous little turquoise blue with white polka dots and a glittery pink bow and yep super super cute ears 
The next pair of ears is the classic rose gold sequin ears. Yes, these are the beautiful rose gold ears that took over Instagram for a while and all of Disney because rose gold is such a huge deal. We know. We know it is. So they're like this pretty rose gold sequins with a sparkly rose gold bow and the sequins go all the way down. So these are a perfect pair of ears. They go with a lot because this rose gold pink color has just kind of become a staple now. So love these. The next pair of ears I'm going to show you are the 2018 Disney ears, which I love because this was the year I was on my program. So I knew I had to get these because it was just like a symbol of being there in 2018 and I love these so much. So here they are. They're kind of different than most of the sparkly Disney ears because they don't have sequins. It's a soft material but it's still very sparkly and I love the color of these and they're like they're almost like a navy so they go with tons as well. And then you have the puffy little bow which I love where you have the partner statue and a little Mickey hat and it's a small world little clock smiley face and teacups and a little Mickey ice cream bar space mountain a bunch of Disney classic things so I love these and I will never ever ever give these away or do anything with these because I love them so much. The next pair of ears are the Animal Kingdom, li well, I guess they're not Animal Kingdom, the Lion King ears, and these are super cute. They're perfect for Animal Kingdom. That's what I was trying to get at. These ears are very soft. They're like a, like a leather, a faux leather material, and they're this pretty brown color. There's a shadow, I hope you can see. A pretty brown with a burlap type bow with this tribal print and then if you can see there's actually a Simba little dangling jewel type thing and they say Akuna Matata on the side. The next pair of ears are the classic furry mini Mickey more mini ears. Um, these are super cute. I got these at Cast Connections again for five dollars but they are super tight like I don't know if that's the reason why these were at Cast Connections, but they were made like, I wonder if this was the kids because they're super tight on my head and they hurt to wear, so I try to like stretch them out, but here is a close up of these. Yes, so just the classic Minnie Mouse red bow with white polka dots. Again, it's another puffy bow, which I love. And we've got the furry black, and these are just perfect to wear with basically anything because it's so classic Disney. The next pair of ears is actually one of my favorite pairs of ears that I have, and that is the gold and black ears. Honestly, there is a hilarious story to these because I thought these were specific to Disneyland Paris, um, but clearly they're not because I got these in Walt Disney World. I saw these online and someone said these were Disneyland Paris ears. And so I looked everywhere and couldn't find them. And then I went to Disney World with my family and we saw them in a store in Epcot. And I was like, these are rare ears. These are Disneyland pairs. I have to get them now. I can't wait until my program because they're going to sell out and whatever. And so <laughs> I got them. And then come to find out they're not Disneyland Paris ears. I don't know where I got that information from. Um, and I just paid full price for no reason. But they're still one of my favorite pairs of ears because I think they are gorgeous. Here they are. They've got another puffy bow, black, and this, it's like a like a copper gold. It's, it's, I don't know. It's very gorgeous, the color. And so we've got the gold sparkly ears and then a black headband. And these are perfect. Next, I have another pair of Cast Connection ears that are super, super, super cute. And they are the polka dot mini ears. They are sequins. Disney loves to do sequin stuff on everything. On their shirts, sweatshirts, spirit jerseys, ears, and I'm all about it. We have black ears with white polka dots and a little red sparkly glitter bow. Um, and these are adorable. And again, they're red and black and they go with everything. So I really like these. The next pair of ears are another classic looking pair. They are the classic red and black Mickey ears. These are black ears with sequins on them and then a red sequin bow. Moving on, we're still going to be in Disney Parks ears, but these are my holiday themed Parks ears. The first pair is another pair I got at Cast Connections, and that is the 
Maleficent ears. Oh, I'm in love with these. These are the Maleficent ears. You can see our little horns and, and this gorgeous jewel in the middle. And then you have the thorns from Sleeping Beauty. You know, that was such a scary scheme. The dragon, the thorns, all of it. Y'all, I've never noticed this. They actually say spellbound on the side. That is so cool. But yes, here are the Maleficent ears. The next pair of ears are the Frozen ears. And this is actually kind of funny because they come with a, on the back, they come with a like head. It's almost like a veil like looking type thing on the back. But I cut that off because I just like the ears regular without that on them and so here are the frozen ears up close these are so pretty and i think they look so wintry and fun and you've got snowflakes with jewels and sequins and then a sparkly bow with a snowflake in the middle these are gorgeous my next pair of ears i actually won in a giveaway a christmas giveaway and they are the christmas snowflake ears from disney last year but so these have a red velvet fabric with a beautiful snowflake on both ears and a green sparkly bow. These are perfect for Christmas time. My next pair of ears I love so much and I knew I had to get them last year. These are the puffball ears. These are so cute. I love them so much. These remind me of like long johns <laughs> like like long underwear that you wear when you go skiing or something this material but anyways so the bow is this really cool like comfy material and it has um, a mickey hat ornament and snowflakes and this little pattern and then the ears are actually puff balls they are so cute the material goes down on both sides of the headband and i love these i will forever love these okay we are done with my disney parks ears and now i'm going to try to speed things up so this video is not like an hour long and show you some of my small shop ears these first three ears are from second star mercantile on etsy and they are adorable great quality ears so i will link them down below and actually i will put their name right here so you can go check them out so first up are the mermaid ears. These are super gorgeous. They definitely make you think of Ariel with the purple and the green. They have some glitter little bubbles and seahorse and shells. And then they have, oop, and then they have an emerald green glittery bow and headband. Gorgeous. Next up are the Lilo and Stitch Ohana ears. Oh, they have Lilo's dress pattern and then they have a big blue leaf and a blue headband. They're very shiny and I love these a whole lot. Next up, these are actually my sister's ears. Um, these are the Epcot Spaceship Earth looking ears with a beautiful gray shiny bow, a gray headband, and then the Spaceship Earth pattern fabric. These next two ears are from a shop called Fairy God Sisters, and I will link them down below and put their name right here so you can check them out. This first pair of ears is super bright and fun and girly. They are just this coral, bright, pinky coral color sequined ears, and they're perfect to go with lots of different colors, and they basically have sequins all over them, and I think these ears are super, super pretty. The next pair of ears from them kind of makes me think of Epcot as well because of this pattern, but it's just a little bit more colorful. They've got the coral bow and some turquoise coral pink and white colors, and these are another gorgeous pair of ears. This next pair of ears I actually made, um, and I'm happy with them, but there were a few mess ups, and I think I made them a little too big, but I've seen people make their own ears online, and I thought, how do they do that? Oh my goodness. And so I looked it up and got some tutorials and ended up being able to make a pair of my own. So I love these, that they're special to me because I made them, but I definitely would have done things a little bit differently. If I make another pair of ears, I'm gonna make them differently. Here are the ears, they're really pretty. There's some gold shiny polka dots, pink, turquoise, some darker pinky corally color. And then I lined them with this little I don't know what it's called, like a little ribbon of little, <laughs> what is this called? Let me know what the heck this is called. And then a gorgeous turquoise bow, and then I just had a white headband. Um, so yeah, here they are. 
These next ears I actually wore in my last video and I linked their shop in the last video but I'm going to do it again. They are my Haunted Mansion ears and this is probably one of my favorite pairs just because I think they're really well made and they're super cute and Haunted Mansion is one of my favorite attractions ever. These ears are from Pinned and Stitched on Etsy and I will link and put their name and all that good stuff below. Here they are. They have the purple Haunted Mansion wallpaper with a cool beaded side. They have a really pretty black metallic leathery type bow in the middle and these ears are just very well made and I love them a whole lot. This next pair of ears I actually won in a giveaway and I was so excited when I won this giveaway because I wanted a pair of these specific ears for a very long time. So these ears are from Ears Full of Sugar Shop. Um, they have an online store and they are home of the confetti ears. So they use this fabric of all different kinds of colors and they call them their confetti ears and they are all so gorgeous. I will link to them below so you can go shop some of their ears. Here are the ones that I won. That, something else about these ears is they are so squishy. Like just look. Ooh, 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 ooh. That was unnecessary. Really beautiful colors on the ears. A gorgeous turquoise bow and they're just super fun and really, really pretty and well-made ears. Guys, this is my last pair of ears and they are one of my favorite pairs of all time. I won these in a giveaway as well. I won lots of giveaways last year. I, now I never win any. Come on. I don't know what it is. But I won these very close to Halloween and I actually was able to wear them on Halloween, which is so fun. These are from Magically Made Studio. Is that right? Yes, I just checked. Magically Made Studio. These are so cool. The perfect Halloween ears. I I, I love these so much. Here is a close-up of these ears. They've got an adorable little Minnie Mouse pumpkin in the middle with a purple sequin bow. And then they've got a bunch of Disney Halloween treats and little Mickey pumpkins and mini pumpkins with a pretty orange headband. And these are just the perfect ears for Halloween. Um, you don't really get much better than this. These are awesome and they're really well made and super, super pretty ears. Well, that is all of the ears I have so far. I have a few more on my list that I really want. Of course, I want the Arendelle Aqua ears. If you haven't seen those, go look at them. They're the most beautiful ears Disney has ever come out with, I feel like. So if my ear collection ever grows significantly, maybe I'll post another video on here. But thank you so much for voting on my Instagram. If you're not following my Instagram and you want to, here is my name. But thank you so much for watching this video. It was probably very long. I'm going to try and cut this as much as I can so you're not sitting here watching me hold up Mickey ears for an hour and a half. Make sure to like and subscribe if you liked watching this video and you like Disney content. I'm going to try and post um, way more than I have been, that's for sure. I'm going to try to do maybe a video a week or something like that unless I'm super busy. Make sure and comment on this video what your favorite pair of ears was. I will be very curious to see which pair you liked the best. So thank you so much and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Mm -hmm.